Good morning, you chubby little bastards. It's time for a snack battle with my fun size human. We got Trader Joe's pumpkin cinnamon rolls versus Pillsbury's pumpkin cinnamon rolls. You like cinnamon rolls? Yeah, he does. As any normal human being does, he enjoys them. So, uh, not much to talk about here. These are both cinnamon rolls. He's entertaining himself. These are both cinnamon rolls, clearly, with pumpkin flavoring and some kind of icing. Yeah, that's a baby. Yeah, good job. So, yeah, and Dada and baby. You're the baby. Did you know that? Okay, you'll get some. Chill out. Uh, let's go. I'm not going to give you your own because, or maybe I, I should give you your own. All right. Let's start off with Pillsbury's. Mm, I think it's a baby size one. Just chill out. I'm gonna give it to you. Do you want this? What do you say? Now what do you say? Now what do you say after I give it to you? You're welcome. That's his word for thank you. Mmm. Ooh. I love it when that, that edge gets crispy on the outside. You know what I'm talking about? Now, the, I, I, this is a spoiler. Without even tasting them, there's a big difference between the Pillsbury rolls and the Trader Joe's rolls. The Pillsbury rolls have that little streusel on the inside in between each roll. I'm going to peel it apart so you guys can see what I'm saying. This part, which is basically uh, a prerequisite for a decent cinnamon roll. And while this isn't the best cinnamon roll I've ever had by any means, it gets the job done. Um, pumpkin flavor is a little bland. The icing is the best part of those. So, um, definitely nothing great. I definitely would much prefer the Cinnabon Pillsbury cinnamon roll. Or, you know, uh, if we're talking just cinnamon rolls, commercial retail cinnamon rolls, I always go Cinnabon. Uh, the prepackaged cinnamon rolls. The ones you, you make yourself, they just never taste as good as the one from the kiosk at the airport. Am I right? Ah. Mm -hmm. I'm always right. Are you digging that? Ah. Yeah. Nothing great, but also uh, a bad worse. I'm going to give that one. <laughs> I'm going to give that the Pillsbury pumpkin cinnamon roll seven yasses out of ten. All right, we got to move on to the next one. So I'm going to take this away from you. All right, chill. Hold your horses, kid. You still have some in your mouth. Did you know that? You can't get more until you swallow that part. All right, on to Trader Joe's version. Like I noted before, Trader Joe's does not have that that little interior, that uh, those little streusel, that streusel coating that the Pillsbury one has. It almost looks like like biscuit dough. Um, so aesthetically, definitely not as good looking as Pillsbury, but it's not about how it looks, Cam. It's about how it tastes when it's in your mouth. You know what I mean? You done with that? Okay. That was disgusting. All right, all right, we'll move on to the next one. Here you go. Trader Joe's, ready? Cheers. Now what do you say? Thank you. No, I gave that to you. you gotta, Tell me something. What's the word? What's the phrase you tell me when I give you something? Cheese. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. Um, if I didn't know any better, like if this didn't have icing on it, I would just think this was a biscuit. It's a decent biscuit, don't get me wrong, right? You know? It's tasty. Flaky. But, if we're grading things on pumpkin flavor here, and grading it as a pumpkin cinnamon roll, it fails miserably. Which is strange because Trader Joe's is typically great. They have a great track record with pumpkin products. But this one just misses the mark. It just tastes like biscuit dough. 
top with some kind of frosting, pumpkin frosting. Uh, and there's definitely not enough of the frosting to make up for the lack of flavor in the dough. The dough itself is fine, it's soft, moist, it's all good, but it's not a pumpkin cinnamon roll. Um, obviously Cam doesn't care. I could run down a litany of things that he's tried to eat and uh, so you gotta understand, don't, don't trust him. All right, his standards are very low. My standards are marginally higher, not that much higher, but high enough. Um, the, so I'm gonna give these five yasas out of 10. The clear winner of today's snack battle is, oh, is it your show now? Okay, I'll just see myself out. Just kidding. <laughs> this is my show, kid. You're not ready to take over for at least another two years. So the Pillsbury cinnamon roll is a superior one, even though it's not that great, it's still better than Trader Joe's. And that's all I have to say about that. Cam and I are gonna eat these cinnamon rolls together now. All part of a balanced breakfast, am I right? High five. Oh. Thanks, I guess. See you guys next time.